Hey, this is Soccer in the South with Wolfman Jeff coming at you. So, this Saturday morning, got a chance to sit down FA Cup. What we'd expected to be a nice, smooth ride. And we also kind of knew it wouldn't be as smooth as we would like. Uh, Shrewsbury has had a lot of fight into them. Uh, they did get past uh, Stoke City. What we didn't expect was a 2-2 draw. And to be quite blunt, we are darn lucky that we did not go down. We almost lost that match. There's just no two ways about it. That is concerning, mates. Um, first of all, I do want to give respect uh, to Shrewsbury, who played played a really solid game. Not every minute, and uh, certainly not every minute were we on the top. Uh, I don't think we were completely awful. We weren't great. Uh, Shrewsbury was mostly good throughout. Uh, we all had our lapses, but uh, Shrewsbury, I, we got to give them credit and uh, respect because uh, they came to play. They had us down 2-0, and uh, that, was, uh, that was concerning. Uh, so uh, we've got a lot of respect for this side. Probably my biggest concern about this match is the reality that as it stands now, it's not safe for us to play without Jimenez on the pitch. We have other people, but we don't really have that same type of striker. We've got other forwards who can come in and contribute, but without Jimenez there, it was a day and night difference. And I was disappointed, particularly with Costa's performance, uh, there were points where uh, Traore contributed and uh, uh, Cav, when he came in, he contributed, but it wasn't quite at the same level um, as we're used to seeing. So their quality dropped. Uh, they did get some assist. Jimenez, if he hadn't come in, I don't, I don't think we would have had this game. Uh, so it's that scares me because if something happens to him, he gets injured. What's going to happen to our Wolves? So uh, we need to rise above and. Uh, We've only got a few days left in January. I don't know if there's anything in the works. So we're probably going to have to work with what we have, which means a lot of work on our other strikers. Um, I love John Ruddy. I'm a big Ruddy fan. I was so excited to see him play again. However, I have to say that Arnold today was the better keeper. And uh, Ruddy had some good saves, but there's a couple of them, and particularly one I, I don't think that would have gotten past John last year so um, they may have gotten lucky but I know Ruddy usually is on it a little more Arnold was fantastic so they have a really quality keeper there um, what I had said on my last video I was thinking that our uh, our West Ham match was at the end of the month but I was thinking there was more of the month left so we're almost out of the month so uh, this coming Tuesday is our last match of the month and uh, we are hosting uh, West Ham. West Ham, if you remember, was uh, one of our first uh, wins in the Premier League this season. Uh, so uh, that was a really emotional game for us. So I have to wonder if West Ham is coming to look for revenge. So I do think there is a lot of work in a short amount of time that Nuno is going to be working on the boys. There's no day off tomorrow. Uh, and Monday the boys are going to be on the pitch working it because we cannot do this with West Ham We will go down if we play this way against West Ham So give me your thoughts. Uh, what do you thought, think about the match? Uh, were you surprised with Shrewsbury? Uh, I'm not sure which lineup change would have done differently. Obviously. I think um, Jimenez starting would have been better But I hate the fact that we have to do that. Let me know your thoughts hit like subscribe hey thanks for watching and uh, being very supportive this has been soccer in the south with wolfman jeff and um came this close to crying in the corner